Hi, my name is Brett Sloman. I'm a product manager at Lecter Software working on the Monaco treatment planning system. Today I'm going to talk a little bit about multiple prescriptions in Monaco. This is a new feature in 5.1 and allows the user to add a prescription to an existing plan in the same way as you would for a boost. In this particular case I have a breast plan and the tangent fields are completed, calculated, ready for treatment but what we want to do is go ahead and add an electron boost. So for this, I'll click on the Add RX button on the prescription dialog, and then I'm going to choose a electron boost template, and go ahead and auto-conform that to the target, which in this case is a lumpectomy PTV with a half centimeter margin, uh, using a 12 MeV electron beam. I'll set the ice center also to the center of that lumpectomy PTV. This template will include the electron applicator uh, snapping the field to the target. Okay, so we have our electron applicator defined with that half centimeter margin to the PTV. We can check the calculation properties that came with the template and make sure that that is what we want for this particular plan. Uh, in this case, I would reduce the grid spacing maybe to 0.3 uh, and I have the option to change the number of histories for the Monte Carlo calculation. Having set that correctly, I'll hit the calculate button and start the dose calculation. So using the beam visibility option, I've turned the dose off for the tangents. I can turn the display of those beams off as well, because at this point we really just want to look at the RxB, which is the electron boost. So we've got this prescribed right now, 1000 centigrade at 2.5 centimeters. If we decide we want um, it to prescribe to a different depth, we can just edit the value here, maybe make it 3.5 centimeters. And the dose will automatically update to reflect the new depth. So now we've got a little bit of coverage. Um, we can see that on the DVH that the GTV is well and truly covered. Uh, if we want to go even higher, we could make that perhaps four centimeters. And um, once we're happy with the dose that the RxB is receiving, the next step is to go ahead and display RxA and RxB together. Okay, so I'll go ahead and turn on the dose and the beams for RxA. So with both plans, both RX is calculated and all of the beams and all the dose turned on, we can evaluate the plan, make sure that RXB is not having any unforeseen impact on RXA once you look at the overlapped uh, hotspots, etc. And if we do need to, we can always flip between the different RXs and make changes to the beam weights, the beam placement, etc. Um, all on the fly until we have the satisfactory plan that we want to treat with. Thanks for watching this video on multiple prescriptions. Keep an eye out for more features on the Monaco 5.1 release.